The use of bridges and tunnels to facilitate transportation through difficult routes by road and rail has become very common around the world. But there are also a few mega-projects that make new history in the field of engineering. So far, we have mentioned many such mega-projects in our various videos which are completely unique and unparalleled in their kind. There are many masterpieces of construction engineers that are mind-boggling. And today, we are going to mention one such tunnel which is being hailed as a new addition to the world of modern construction. Today, we will explore this mega-tunnel project and uncover all its fascinating details. Before we start, be sure to click on the subscribe button and like this video as it's the best way to support this channel. Located on both sides of the Danube River in northwest Austria, Linz is famous for its Roman Catholic bishopric built in 1785, museums and art galleries, among other beautiful buildings. Due to the increasing population and the constant influx of tourists, traffic problems have increased here to reduce which various projects have been constructed from time to time. Though it is not difficult to get around in Linz either by tram, car or bicycle, but do massive solid rocks on both sides of the river, construction of roads for transportation to the northern and southern parts of the city is a challenge. A construction project called the A26 Linzer Autobahn, that is four-lane western bypass, has been fast-tracked since January 2019 to reduce traffic pressure on the existing bridges built over the river, crossing one of the busiest waterways in Europe, as well as rail tracks and two highways. Under this project, the 305 meter long and 22.54 meter wide suspension bridge under construction over the river will be connected with approximately 3.3 kilometer long northbound and southbound junction twin tunnels on the valley side to link riverbank highways. The vertical rock slopes of the Danube Valley allow the 500 meter long and weigh around 900 tons supporting cables for the suspension bridge to be anchored directly into the rock, eliminating the need for pylons. This fourth bridge across the Danube River in the city is part of a major infrastructure development in the country. The megastructure is planned as a composite steel construction, with a steel box girder and crossbeams spaced at the intervals of the hangars. The suspension cable bundles are composed of 12 parallel and locked spiral cables and have a diameter of 95 mm. The hangers are also designed as spiral ropes and are connected to the suspension ropes by rope clamps manufactured as castings. Building tunnels in hard rock mountains to connect this suspension bridge with the existing highways is not an easy task either. Thus, the use of tunnel boring machine to construct tunnels in the mountains has become common. This giant machine also completes the initial construction of the concrete tunnel by excavating through the mountain. But this machine, which is about 50 meters wide and approximately 200 meters long, proves to be very expensive. As for the project under construction in Linz, the tunnel boring machine is not useful enough to construct various turns on the 1600 meter long route through solid rock along the bank of the Danube River. In such a situation, instead of using TBM, the engineers decided to clear the tunnel path with the help of explosive materials. In this method, after drilling into the rock, explosives are placed in these holes and detonated. This process is continued until the tunnel is formed. In construction of a 26 Linzer Autobahn, a new method was adopted to prepare these tunnels. That is first, the tunnel path was cleared by drill and blast, with the debris taken away along the river by boats. Then, after installing the basic iron structure on the walls of the tunnel, concrete was sprayed on it to create initial stabilization. A large part of the tunnel is built underground to minimize noise and pollution in the urban area. According to the plan, these walls were covered with waterproof sheets, but this was only the base of the tunnel. After waterproofing the entire tunnel, it was now time for smooth finishing. In the next phase, the use of a 250-ton fully hydraulic special purpose steel machine called the Formwork Carriage was started. This machine was custom made for this mega project. After dividing the entire tunnel into 180 sections, they were concreted in stages. Interestingly, the machine was trucked in parts to the site, where it was assembled. The workers assembled the machine according to the size of the tunnel, so that it could move through the tunnel easily. After the machine was inserted into the tunnel, it was adjusted again, so that it would be closer to the hard rocky walls. 
Finally, the gap between the formwork and the walls was filled with concrete, resulting in a smooth lining in this section of the tunnel. After the work was completed, the formwork was stopped at the same place inside the tunnel for the next 24 hours, so that the machine could be moved to the next section after the concrete had dried thoroughly. During this entire process, special care was taken to time and stop the machine so that all sections of the tunnel could be completed equally. Even a short delay during this time could have ruined the whole project. The chief engineer of the project says that the most difficult phase of the tunnel construction project was the lack of space required during the work. Because the inner part of the machine was very narrow compared to the outer curve, it was forced to spend more time pumping concrete on both sides. The length of the formwork could simultaneously pump concrete to a 12 meter space. A few tight bends in the route allowed the worker to use half of the machine, creating six meters of concrete curves in the tunnel. Due to the tight turning radius in the tunnel, an advanced caterpillar system was used to move the formwork machine. Due to this slow but very careful process, the construction of various angle bends in the tunnel was completed. Engineers say that throughout the project, they faced new challenges every day, which forced them to think about the best solutions. The happiness is that the tunnel will benefit millions of people after its completion. But all the engineers and workers who work day and night on this difficult and complex project may not be remembered by anyone. The project will be completed by October 2024, as per the schedule of about 49 months. This is one of the many mega projects that are reshaping the world with the power of construction. Of course, you know that the world's first tunnel was built in the Greek island of Samos in 530 BC to supply water to the capital of the island. One of the three wonders of the Hellenic world, this tunnel was one kilometer long. In terms of transportation, the Butterley Gang Road Line Railway Tunnel in England is the oldest surviving tunnel in the world. The A26 project stands as a crucial infrastructure initiative in the Austrian city of Linz and its neighboring regions, aiming to alleviate traffic congestion within its urban transport system. The successful execution of the project relied on a cutting-edge Peary engineering solution that seamlessly blended innovation, safety, and efficiency, complemented by extensive project support. Notably, a significant milestone was achieved with the introduction of Austria's inaugural fully hydraulic tunnel formwork carriage, featuring a caterpillar drive. Many tunnels built in the mountains are considered monuments in history till date. What do you think is the most complex tunnel ever built around the world? If the video has increased your knowledge, please like and share it, and be sure to drop a line in the comment section.